Yeah, the timing thing, it's like the way that melody sits on that da do it da do it is uh, It's about the, it's about the pickups, right? It's what's the that? pickups. It's the 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 rhythm the yeah. time signatures based like Black Dog Led Zeppelin. Da 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 you know, you have to uh, have to think about it that way. I don't, if you, where's the one? Yes. Yeah, was it the first note you heard or three later or whatever? Yeah, exactly. Yeah. The pickups. Yeah, that's how I put it. Yeah. yeah. Well, if you've seen Brian Sutton live, uh you know, with uh, Hot Rise, you know, that band with Tim O'Brien or, or whatever. I, yeah, I, I don't know. I've been at festivals. Everyone's doing their solos. Everybody's grooving along. Brian Sutton does a solo. And the audience jumps to their feet. They're like, oh, my God. <laughs> he just, he wrecks <laughs> yeah. everybody, you know? Well, it, it sounds like a whole pack of masterful players, right? And then, then this guy's going to rise to the top of that. That's cool. Yeah, he's, he makes it look real easy, too. He's just so relaxed, you know? Yeah, and, and again, very inventive uh, and uh, does those kind of uh, finger twisters that you go, how's he going to get out of this? And he always knows, you know, I'm coming right back here to that G-run, you know? <laughs> yeah, 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 he's great. Uh, and so, yeah, people should definitely check him out. Um, so next, um, we're kind of getting into... Um, some of the modern players now that are, you know, of the of the vanguard of the moment. Uh, and um, this is a guy who's kind of taken the bluegrass world by storm, uh, a young uh, guy named Billy Strings. Um, don't know if that's his original name. Um, but uh, Billy's um, really coming out of the, the Doc Watson, Tony Rice thing. Um, and kind of unapologetically. And I think his place is kind of, um, you know, he's a young guy that, that audiences and young audiences really relate to. And they're, they're hearing, you know, the sound, some of these young audiences for the first time, I think. And, uh, and he's, uh, um, also got a personal story of redemption. You know, he was a drug addict and, uh, this song is kind of an updated song about the evils of liquor and things, those old traditional bluegrass songs. But now he's talking about meth. Yeah, the dust in the baggie, right? Yeah. And uh, so let's listen to a little Billy Strings. <laughs> <laughs> 